So what we basically try to do is to do more hotspot policing, right? And uh, we try to restrict these vehicles to the respective areas so as not to have them stray away, right? And um, it is something that we believe will work better for us in 2017. We just started it since we got the fleet of vehicles. So we're anticipating that 2017 will be a good year for us from a police standpoint, considering the fact that we have our vehicle resources and they are deployed accordingly to be able to effectively police Southside Belize City. You know that we were done with vehicle resources and um, the seven additional vehicles boost our vehicle fleets and we were able we are now able to provide patrols on a more wider scale and in a more timely manner. And if you look at each of the vehicles assigned to South Side, you will see that each vehicle have a designated area. I don't know if you all had noticed that, but there is a vehicle that is assigned to the Genosha Boulevard area and it is marked right on the doors of the vehicles. There is one assigned to the Yabra area. So the one for the Jane Usher Boulevard area is basically responsible to, to police the Jane Usher Boulevard area that will be from Farber's Road Junction to Jane Usher Boulevard all the way to the back. Then we have the one that is for the Yabra that is assigned to the Gill Street, T Street, um, Nurse Finlay, Alan Pitts, Crescent, that general area to Caesar Ridge to Farber's Road.